So in this video, we are going to show you how to grind or craft the 81 plus team of the week upgrades. As we have a look at requirements here, we're going to go through a lot of budgets. We need to have 384s and an 83 minimum. So I'm going to show you a little tricks here how to do it. So let me complete this SPC quick. So in my club, I have 184 and 285s. But as you can see, if you have 285s or an 84 or obviously higher, you don't have to put in 83. So we've actually got ourselves 481s here and then 482s. 184 and 285 so depending on what you get from the upgrades what well, i'm going to show you the fro the process of how to do it it depends what you get so let's go and submit this now see what we get out of this you're basically going to want to use these team of the weeks for black friday i can imagine ea going to bring out an abundance of spcs that are going to require team of the weeks this is not investment advice it's just something to consider and this is basically the best way to get them and the most efficient way we're doing this all the time, so we get an 81 plus between week 1, which is the first week of FIFA, to week 9. So as you can see here, we're probably going to get ourselves an 81. Dutch right wing back. Is that going to be Frimpong? It is an 83. So an 83 team of the week actually helps out a lot with other SBCs. So let's say you have a lot of things in your club in terms of golds, Libertadores, etc. You can do many, many things with that in terms of how to do the SBCs. So if we were to go back to the SBCs, a little trick here to add them to favourites. All you want to do is go to the SBC, press Y or triangle so that little marker comes up in the corner. Oh, you can't see on my screen. See the little marker there, a little star pops up. That means it's added to your favourites and then it's under favourites all the time. You're going to want to have the bronze, the silver, the World Cup and Black Friday is finally here. Go to Alt Knight, select foot, select foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy. Select your payment method and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. Every purchase has a chance to to win ten dollars so with the 81 double you need to have yourselves 11 rares so the best things i can recommend doing is finish off marquee matchups make sure you get all of these done then once you've done that you get yourself a lot of gold packs back plus a silver pack which is kind of interesting then you're gonna have to go in to the silver upgrade to get yourself three commons and then of course once you've got yourself a lot of gold commons you're then going to want to have to go and add this SBC here to get two rares. It's going to be a long process for people that don't have coins in their account or many cards even, sorry. With coins, you can obviously buy them. But if we were to look at some other things, we have got flash SBCs. They come every two hours after this one ends. So the trick is, is to finish this off as quickly as you can. Get the golds back. So you can see here we need to have minimum silver, eight rare, four golds as well, and four from one club. So let me just complete this quickly. So we have done this SBC now. Remember, as I mentioned, they are going to be there every couple hours. So we can see there's one hour and 19 minutes left. It's a flash SBC. So that means every two hours is going to be a new one. So you want to check that. That's going to be out through the whole entire promo or at least the first couple days. So it's really important that you check them, especially to do this, because a lot of them are going to need silvers and bronzes. What I'd recommend doing is going through and picking up a load of silvers and storing them in the club for minimum price because eventually they're going to go up. So say you've done that SPC and you've done the marquee matchups, you're going to want to obviously, of course, open up the packs. Anything you get that's worth coins, make sure you sell or save them for the future promo coming out tomorrow, for example. But for this video, we'll just open them now. So we do get ourselves an 84 Tonali. So there are a couple of things you can do. You can either go out and buy the rares if you need them, or of course, you can try and grind them as we're going to show. So we're going to go with the grinding method and just see if anybody's worth anything here. It doesn't look like it. Open up these picks. These are becoming extremely annoying now because most likely everybody's got all of them or you get duplicates. Oh, well, we didn't actually get any duplicates that time. So you saw that into the club. Once you've done that, and like I said, marking matchups, you then got yourself a few golds. We are going to do 180 plus double, but what I would recommend doing is waiting till tomorrow when the promo is fully out. Because right now, there are only team of the weeks in packs. So I don't think it's worth it just for that. But we'll do it just for argument's sake. If you don't know, Libertadores also count as rare, so try and put as many of them in as you can. A lot of people forget they have to be 75 rated or higher, so don't put anybody else underneath 75 rated because they won't count. So as you can see here, we're going to go to a low to high as well. We're going to put these in. And that is the last one done. As you can see there, we've got ourselves 11 rare, two goals, and everybody else is Libertadores. So you can either save these packs, as I've mentioned, and wait till tomorrow night when content comes out, or whatever time of day it is for you, or open them now. I'd highly recommend saving them. Don't open them now. But for the video, we'll open them just to see what the pack weight's like on them. So you get yourself two 81 pluses. As we open up the first one, it's going to be a boards by the looks of it. French, centre mid, is that going to be Lamar? So 83 there. That's going to help us with the team of the week. So we've got two 83s. And that is one way to put in the 83s there. So you're looking for 84s, of course. 
with marquee matchups and much more you can do that way so let's say you have a lot of stuff in your club that's the way to do it if you don't have much in your club there are a few things you can do so we have icons here these icons not the loans the normal icons have these two requirements where it needs bronze rares and silver rares meaning that prices go up on them and you can see here you get yourself a small election players pack back on both of them or a double gold pack depending on where they are so for example sanchez two small election but if we go to Rykard or Lampard or Nedved, whoever else is there, you can see they're two rare gold. So that's going to give you four back. They are tradable and you do get yourself, of course, some coins back if you need it or at least four cards minimum into the pack. So what we're going to do here is go to this. We're going to open up a bronze pack and you basically, I've done it several times, so I'm only going to open three packs. But the way I like to do it is we have 10,000 coins. You open up 10,000 coins worth of bronze packs and then you go through. So we're going to check everybody's price here. So French centre backs right now, as you can see, are going for about 1,000 coins because of that Flash SPC. And this is really important to remember when Flash SPCs come out, like the Black Friday one. Certain cards are going to go up in price. So you want to sell everything that's worth coins and keep anything else that's not. So this bronze rare also looks like he goes for at least 300. So we have made what all together double our coins on that pack and we've managed to keep ourselves two bronze commons which i haven't spent a penny on if you were to buy them for a minimum price that's 300 coins or 400 if you were to buy them now so that's really good value doing this while the spcs are out again another rare you're trying to get a rare every time if you can get a major nation rare just like this guy here you are looking at serious coins right now as you can see three thousand coins minimum and we have made some big profits from doing this already, not spending any coins. And you can do two things. You can either use these cards here to sell them and basically buy the rares that you need to do the SPCs. Or you can do it the way which is more efficient, but it is much more time consuming to do. So let's open up one more bronze pack just to show the example, as you can see here. And then we'll show the transfer list at the end of the video to show that these cards have sold. Lucky enough, we got ourselves another rare. You don't get a rare every time, I can guarantee you that. And it's going to be a Spanish right mid rare. And these seem to be going for crazy money as well right now. So there's another 1,000 coins there. So we have actually made profit on every single pack so far. The Spanish right back looks like he's going to go for at least 600. So again, more profit for us. And it's just as simple as that. With the Chinese left mid, what does he go for? Nothing. And an English manager. I doubt he goes for anything. He does it. Always check your manager, especially Korean, Brazilian, France, Dutch, anything like that. Because they always go for loads and loads of coins. So let's say now you spent your 10,000. You've gone through over and over again. You're going to want to put these bronze commons into this SPC now. Into this bronze upgrade. It gives you two silvers back, one rare, one common. We've, do this 11 times, of course. Put the 11 rares you get as long as you don't get duplicates. And that counts for Libertadores between the ratings of 65 to 74. Into those icon SPCs, as I mentioned. Put the silver commons into this. You get yourself three commons back. You need to do this SPC four times to then get yourself two gold rare. And then the two gold rares, of course, go into the 81 plus upgrade, which then you get yourself 83, 84 to put into the week. But just to show you here, we opened up three packs. We made, what, 4,000, 4,900, 5,500 coins. Three packs is going to come around the price of about 2,300 or altogether. So we've actually made 3K easy without even selling this guy yet, plus the stuff we kept and what we discarded. So really, really easy coins. If you have any questions, please comment down below. If you are new to the channel, hit that like button, subscribe, and catch you in the next one. Soon.